Hey, what's up, guys? In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a DIY CO2 system for your uh, planet aquarium. Uh, what you're going to need is some yeast, some baking soda, sugar, uh, two bottles. Uh, if you really want to, you only need, you can only use one if you want, one big one. Um, some rubber tubing and your funnel on top of your uh, on top of your big bottle here. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to take two and a quarter cups of sugar carefully dump it in the funnel here So sugar's in there, two and a quarter cups. Then you're going to want to take your yeast, grab a spoon, and you're going to want to do uh, one and a half tablespoons. There's one. You're going to add also one tablespoon of baking soda as I spill it everywhere. And drop that in there. So and right there is two and a quarter cups of sugar, a tablespoon and a half of yeast and a tablespoon of baking soda and after that what you're going to want to do is take it and go fill it up with lukewarm water now I just filled it up uh, about three-fourths of the way with water um, and now what you're going to want to do is take it make sure your hands securely on the top take it Give it a good shake, mix it all up. There we got it mixed up pretty well. You can you'll know when it's all blended in there. Um, and what you're gonna want to do is take the lid that you got. I, you know, I uh, use electrical tape to put the, uh, the air tubing in there. I also use some silicone around the edge here to make sure it's all sealed up good. Screw that on. Um, this thing's really optional. It's just basically used as a bubble counter. You fill it up with water and uh, you stick this in here. The lid for that, it's got two hoses on it. One that uh, counts the bubbles and then the CO2 will come back up through this one. And this one was what runs into the tank. Um, so we set that in there. Um, if you guys are going to do that, I'd recommend about two bubbles per second, maybe two to three. Um, I think that would be a good number, but you know that's optional. And I'm just doing it because I already had this pre-made a long time ago. Um, so I fill this up about halfway with water, and then you know then you can count the bubbles that come out um, to see how much CO2 is going into your tank. So that's pretty much it. Uh, thanks for watching, guys.